Hi, it's Mike Stevenson here. So this is the second video about um, how we configure the Logic app in DevOps. So the, the example we were looking at previously was um, <clears throat> a Logic app where we had this Logic app.parameters.template where the DevOps pipeline was going to inject variables or in inject um, stuff to replace the parameters with actual values. So this value here was going to come from Key Vault. This was going to come from a common settings. And there was a couple of different ways we're going to look at how you could do that. The last time we looked at it using the DevOps library. Um, this setting here is a pipeline or a, a logic app specific just to this interface. So we used a pipeline variable to inject this parameter. So this time, if we have a quick look, um, we're going to look at this particular pipeline here. And um, what this pipeline is going to do that's slightly different to the other one. Um, is first off I'm just going to check I've removed my so we don't have the link to the library with a common settings in this time that's the bit that's going to be different we still have the solution specific um, kind of um, pipeline in here so it's going to have a slightly different name because the pipeline's different and um, what's different this time though is we've We've got the key vault stuff that's going to, or the key vault tasks, going to grab the secrets, put them as pipeline variables. But instead of the common library, this task is going to go and grab the settings from um, app config and it's going to inject those as pipeline variables. And then we'll be to use those to inject into the um, logic app. Everything else is the same as before, so this is going to show the pipeline variables. This is going to do a replace tokens. And we've got the the under double underscore prefix and suffix, and this is going to deploy the logic app. So the only thing that's really changed in this pipeline is we're using app config instead of the the library of common settings. So if we have a quick run of this pipeline, we'll let this run through. I'll just pause the video a second until the pipeline finishes to make the video a bit shorter. Hi, Mike Stevenson again. So, um, although I got distracted for a few minutes with an email there, um, the pipeline successfully ran, and we can see the um, the one difference here. We've got the key vault bit as before. Um, <clears throat> we've got the um, app settings from app config, and when we do this show variables, you can see we've still got common setting mockery API here, and the, um, the secret was further down. I'm trying to remember where that was now. There we go, so the mockery key here. We replaced the tokens just like before, so they were fine. So really everything else was the same. The only difference was that um, URL came from app config instead of the library. Just showing that you can you can do two approaches here depending on what your preference is. And if we go back over to the logic app and we should be able to see this time the um, the variable got set from the other pipeline. Everything else is the same. Um, and that's all good and you know so it's basically there's two slightly different ways of doing the DevOps pipeline where you can use those common settings in a slightly different way um, so I hope these these videos are useful for people to um, just try and simplify that management of config settings a little bit